How you doing everybody? Nick DiVirgilio here sitting behind this beautiful DW Collector Series finish ply kit. But what I'm here to talk to you about is the 9502 LB Remote Hi-Hat. A very cool hi-hat that is just fun to play because it takes you away from your normal hand. Well, if you don't play open-handed like this, if you play normal with your right hand as the lead over your left hand, it takes you away from that and just changes up the setup. And it's a really smooth feeling hi-hat pedal as well. It feels just about the same as your normal hi-hat pedal. Since this is part of DW's 9000 series, it's their top of the line hardware. All of the connections, the way the setup goes, the ease of use, it's all top notch. Let's get into the details right now. Okay, on my left side, the foot pedal side, great setup over here, really adjustable in many different ways. They call it their unibody folding footboard which basically means it just packs up nice and small, it's compact. The legs also swivel so you can turn them left and right and set them wherever is most comfortable for you. Sometimes your pedal setup might be really tight and you might not have a lot of room and the way they made these adjustments over here make it so you can squeeze the pedal in just about anywhere in your setup. All right, this 9502 LB remote hi-hat comes standard with an eight foot long cable. But if you so desire and you need it, you can talk to your Sweetwater sales engineer and you can order a two, four, six, and or 10 foot cable if you like. They all attach the exact same way. Great high grade, sturdy cable, easily adjustable. So you can set it up anywhere in your drum kit. All right, now I'm gonna get up, walk around and show you the ins and outs of this side of the remote hi-hat. All right, before I get into all of the details about this part of the remote hi-hat here, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to attach the cable. There's a tension screw right here about halfway up the housing. Just loosen it up. There's another tension screw that holds this part of the cable in. Loosen it up and it all comes out. Simple as that. And there's your cable right there. This is the piece that locks on to the housing right in the back here. To put it in, just stick it through the hole. Push that in, put it right up in there. Lock it down and you're good to go. Very easy. Right here is where you adjust the spring tension of your remote hi-hat stand. Again, it's very easy to do. There's a locking screw on the back right here. You loosen that up. It sets this piece free and you just adjust it to wherever you feel comfortable. It sets it, makes it either harder and or easier to play. And then once you get it where you like, lock this screw down and it stays in place for you. Again, really simple and easy to use. If you want to adjust how your cymbal sits level and or angled, sometimes hi-hat, you like to have the bottom cymbal angled up a little bit so you get that nice chick sound when you close the cymbals together. They call this the lateral cymbal seat. It's really, again, a really easy, adjustable thing. You just, there's a wing nut right here, and all you do is turn it, and that moves the cymbal at an angle or sits it back down flat. The final thing I'm going to talk to you about is the drop clutch. This is a really cool feature because you can very easily turn your get your clutch turned on or off while you're playing. All it is is this. Right now, it's attached like a normal hi-hat. When I move the foot pedal, the hi-hat symbol goes up and down. But all I have to do, you gotta get the coordination down when you do this, but they put a little rubber piece around the clutch right here. And basically when you turn this off, the symbol goes down and now it's closed. So you can play like double kick drums with your hi-hat closed and get your metal on, right? And all you have to do to reattach the clutch to grab the cymbal and bring it up like a normal hi-hat is push down the foot pedal and it grabs the clutch right here and you're back to your normal setting. Really, really cool feature. Again, if you want it to go off, just hit that. Just like that. Now the key is while you're playing is to try and hit this piece of rubber right here so you can do it all in real time while you're playing a groove. Let me give you a quick demonstration on how this works. It does take a little getting used to and some coordination, but as soon as you kind of practice a little bit, you'll get that part, no problem. And there you have it, everybody, the DW9502 LB Remote Hi-Hat. Great feeling remote hi-hat pedal. A lot of fun to play. If you want any more information about this piece of DW gear, just contact your Sweetwater sales engineer.